a lot of the people uh, sometimes get confused around the basic terminologies between business continuity and disaster recovery that's why i just w- wanted to create a video so that i can make you understand what are the key differences between both of them what is a business continuity plan and what is business continuity and what is disaster recovery plan and, and what is disaster recovery all about okay so just to give you a glimpse before starting the slides disaster recovery whenever comes to your mind always think about technology technology function technology services it functions it services always whenever disaster recovery comes to your mind the first thing should be it services okay just take this as a you know suggestion which will help you understand the uh, process better so now let us try to understand what is business continuity business continuity as the name suggest the main purpose here is to enable the business to keep on going continue even in the case of a major disruption now what are the chances of a major disruption guys so number one it could be a man made disruption like a malware attack or ransomware attack or it can be uh, you know natural disaster as well like earthquake fire floods they could be anything so now business continuity what it says is it wants your business to survive it wants your business to continue despite of the major disruption that has happened okay that is the whole focus here and it is a strategic and tactical capability of any organization to plan for and respond to incidents and business disruptions in order to continue their business operations at an acceptable predefined level now what is acceptable predefined level it means that the entire business entire functions entire domains entire departments could not be mobilized at uh, you know the same level so you have to come to a place where you understand what are the critical business functions what are the uh, you know critical areas of the business which you want to uh, you know uh, back up and uh, restore as a first priority so you have to define that that's why you have to accept predefined levels which parts of the business will be up and which parts of the business might remain down for a while as well okay it is a part of the bcp exercise so after that disaster recovery so when we talk about disaster recovery it is a process policy and procedure relating to preparing for recovery or continuation of as i said in the beginning technology infrastructure technology services which are critical to an organization after a natural or human induced disaster has occurred and this is by wikipedia okay now as i have already mentioned the emphasis in case of disaster recovery is on technology infrastructure and services restoration while in business continuity it is on business operations okay how to restore business operations which business operations need to be restored first what is the restoration criteria who will perform the restoration things like that okay so disaster recovery now as you can see is a part of the business continuity guys okay disaster recovery is a smaller part of the whole business continuity pie okay and it can be considered as one of the main enablers of business operations because everything in the business nowadays uh, relies on technology that's why it is considered as one of the main elements now when we talk about implementation of business continuity business continuity is mainly a business thing as you have already known by now it's basically for business side business heads department heads uh, you know uh, executive team board level people to actually lead this kind of an exercise why because only then uh, the remaining parts of the organization would be able to have acceptance with the overall plan for business continuity as well as these people are the best just to understand from a business point of view it would not be able to in a position you know suggest such a thing so if it would be implementing business continuity it would not be able to define the criticality from a business standpoint that is better done by the department heads the functional heads the uh, the c level people the executive teams okay so 
this is what is basically I wanted to discuss about. And I hope you must have got some clarity around business continuity and disaster recovery. Again, uh, before ending the call, just make sure whenever somebody says disaster recovery, the first thing that should come to your mind is IT services and IT infrastructure guys. And uh, the second thing, BCP is a bigger pie and disaster recovery is a part of BCP guys. If you have any questions, any follow up things that you wanted to ask, feel free to ask in the comment section.